1940 Ford fenders being cavernous up inside due to the ride height of this car you can see that several of the top several inches of this tire are hidden by the fender because the car sits so right so when I'm going to put a tire net on it's going to be a little bit of a challenge getting up in there a lot of the exotic sports cars Porsches Ferraris etc are a real bear to get underneath. And while we haven't set this trailer up quite yet with the necessary tie down here, we just thought we'd bring you this video to show you another use of the chassis stabilizer. Now this is intended to be inflated just to take the bouncing out of the car's suspension while you're traveling. However, another nice use of it is to put it under the car, air it up to gain more clearance in the in the fender over the tire area here. Be careful not to get yourself underneath it. This is not a jack, but it does provide temporary clearance to make the job easier of getting the net in place. Once the net is in place, simply deflate the stabilizer to the appropriate inflation level for your trip. Leave it in place beneath the chassis. Now, depending on the chassis design would determine where you're going to elevate this car. This is a dropped axle car, so it doesn't do us any good to lift on the axle, obviously, because the tire is just going to travel up with the body. So what we're going to do is lift it by the X member, which is a little bit further back than we'd like. However, I think it'll do the job just fine. To give you a six foot length on the hose here, which makes it really nice. And if you happen to have a dragster chassis or something that's really narrow, you can always couple the inflation valve directly to the nipple on the, on the stabilizer and eliminate this hose kit. Might be a little simpler for you. So remember to open the ball valve, of course, before you start to inflate it. That's what happens when you reach 25 PSI, which is also maximum inflation. Now I just put this under the back of the wishbone and you can see that it's cradled nicely beneath there and we've gained probably two inches here. Now I know you're saying two inches in much, but I wanted that all my life. 